Good morning. Today is the day after my event and also a new vlog. Hey, guess what I'm doing today, guys? Okay, you took too long. I am going to the NAACP Image Award. I like to take my photo. As you can see, I am molding my hair right now. Y'all know the vibes, y'all know the drill. I ain't gonna show y'all the whole get ready. I'm gonna take y'all along with me as much as I can, so stay tuned. Okay, so I totally finished getting ready without showing you guys. Charge it to my head, not my heart. All right, this is my lovely friend, Brianna Love hey, Vegas. Hey. And we are headed, well, we're parking now and we're about mm -hmm. to walk in and then turn up. I'm gonna show y'all what I can. We're not supposed to have our phones, so you gonna see what I could see, maybe. Um, yeah. I don't have my phone, so I'm gonna just record. <laughs> Alright, before I get in trouble. <laughs> so we are in this holding room. This is like Salad. Oh, no. <laughs> Salad. <laughs> We're seated. We have water. No, They're not feeding us at all. I guess I'm gonna do a review after this entire experience of being a seat filler in LA. Cause it's exciting, like it's an NAACP award. So it's an experience. You gotta sacrifice some things like your time. Your feet. Your, your, your hunger. Your hunger, okay. That's a tip, eat before you come. She did. Twice. Twice. Have snacks and your little clutch guys. In your chest pocket. What we doing it? Uh, pray for my battery, okay. I'm gonna take a nap, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Like last night I got in, I wanna say like at one something, and then I was on the phone until like 2.30 in the morning, and got up at seven. So, just my face, we gonna hope it preserves. <laughs> Six and a half hours later. Okay guys, so it is over. Look at our seats. We ended up sitting super close. Like, it's, it was been a great time. Um, I'm gonna talk about it later. But right now, I'm just like, I think y'all might have seen me on TV. People taking me. Oh, let me get a picture. Um, I love you guys. So we made it. <laughs> it was fun. I didn't yeah. eat, but I didn't pass out. So amen to that. Wow, we were literally sitting like three, four rows behind Rihanna. Like her air was my air, was our air. The um, right behind Lizzo. We, we saw Morgan Freeman. He was like a row down, yeah. two rows down. We, we could touch Lee. We could, okay, reach out and just. With her friends. Uh, who else? Titus Burgess. Yes, Michael B. Jordan, yeah. Jamie Foxx. But some rattlers were sitting right behind us. In there. Would you do seat filler again? I think I would. Yeah. Depending on the opportunity. Yeah. But different shoes. Different shoes. Yeah. It's like now we know we could bring us some snacks. Right. I'm gonna show y'all the shoes I got on. I didn't show y'all. These were the shoes that I had on. No shame in my game, honey. Right. Um, she had on some pumps. Yeah. Right, comfy and cute, period. Oh. A lot of seat fillers got moved around, but we didn't. Oh. We were favor. favor. And we were in the first group. And we in the first group. Let's talk about it. I just got back home from the NAACP Image Awards. I had a really good time, y'all. They had a seat filler opportunity. You can volunteer to be a seat filler. Um, for a lot of award shows, that they, they have this. Usually, you go through a company. Sometimes, you can go directly to the website of the award show and if you really do your looking or type in volunteer for seat filler you can find it this one was actually sent to me by a homegirl of mine i applied and i didn't find out until like two days prior that i got it so i was like oh okay cool like that's how i'm spending my saturday we had to get there at 1 p.m the show didn't start until five and it's like pretty much first come first serve we actually got there right at one it's crazy how the timing worked out it was perfect timing we were in the first batch of seat fillers they had us sitting in a waiting room and then like we went to another room and then we sat there for a little bit and then we went to another room and um i took a nap y'all i was tired and then from there they took us into the auditorium 
and we we waited for like two hours in there just for it to start and then they finally moved us where they moved us to i was sitting like right in the front i was sitting right behind rihanna michael b jordan there were so many people like sitting right next to me we couldn't be on our phones so i didn't record or try to take a picture because i didn't even want to try to mess that up as a seat filler once the people who own those seats or like bought those seats or even celebrities who need to sit down, come in, you're supposed to move. And like literally everyone around us was getting moved. But by the grace, me and my girl, we weren't moved at all. So it was so cool. I got to see Janelle Monet, Morgan Freeman, Jamie Foxx. It was a lot of amazing people in the room. Don't mind my blinds, they just stressed. And then your girl was on TV because I had to turn up when her and Skip Marley performed. And I want you to know right now, right now. I'm like, that is my jam. I'm gonna stand up, I'm gonna say, period. So, and I was shaking y'all because at first I was scared to jam, but I'm like, girl, step into your light and jam out. Blah, blah. Shout out to all my island masters. Y'all know I'm Bahamian, right? Okay, cool. I had a really good time. It just made me reflect and think about so much as far as what I want my legacy to be and how am I giving back to the world, to my community. It had me thinking about it a lot. Still is. And I'm just, my heart is so full. Would I be a seat filler again? Knowing what I know now, yes. If y'all want me to do a video on how to be a seat filler or tips to be, you know, have a good time as a seat filler, let me know in the comments below. Black History Month is coming to an end. And honestly, we need a longer month. And I'm gonna end it on that note. As always, be love. Most importantly, be like. Peace.